there are 24 million people living in Los Angeles trying no, to... No, that's wrong. That is a made-up number you just said. <laughs> so, I'm do it again. There are about 800 people living in Los You're Angeles. Wrong. That's just so wrong. I thought you were going to Google this. I did, but I don't want to count fat people or children. Many, many people dream of being a successful actor. The pretty ones move to Los Angeles, and the others, well, they're in New York or Canada. If you're one of the lucky people living in L.A., you never know who could be watching you shop at Trader Joe's for that package of pre-cooked lentils. Casting directors, producers, and managers roam the streets of Hollywood like a gorgeous, trendy plague. Here are three easy steps that will help you to make sure that you're ready when that moment happens that you're going to be discovered. <laughs> I'm ready. <laughs> I know. Lesson number one. Have a monologue ready. Casting directors are notorious drunks, but they are also impressed with actors who can memorize large pieces of dialogue where only you talk and your co-stars listen silently in awe. This is called a monologue. When you are ready to dazzle the nearest casting director with your monologue, remember to hang around places that have a lot of vodka, like a bar or a set of a reality show. I chose this liquor store in Hollywood for my location. Here we go. Damn you! I waited for you, you son of a bitch! You're pretty. What is this? No! Vodka! Again! Damn you! I smell a callback. Lesson number two. Showcase your special talent. Agents are constantly looking for new talent with a unique or impressive skill on their resume. For example, not a lot of actors can also sing. If you are one of the gifted few who can do both, start singing in places where you can be seen by the right people. Runyon Canyon is a popular place for those who don't want to look like they ate an entire pie for breakfast. On a side note, wear lots of makeup, even when working out. This will remind people that you are an actress and too pretty for community theater. A-E-I-O-U, sometimes why? I know. Shut up! Know. Oh, wait! You forgot my business card! You see that? I do my own stuff! And the third and final lesson is being comfortable with nudity. It's become completely acceptable for A-list actresses to show their breasts in film. Kate Winslet recently won Best Actress for her role as Hannah Schmitz in the film The Reader, which was based off of a German novel. If you want to be taken seriously as an actress, you have to be willing to show your boobies. Taking a cue from Miss Winslet, I have decided to go into this quaint German restaurant. Yeah, was fällt Ihnen denn ein? Sie, 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 Sie flitschen, Sie, 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 das sind die hässlichsten Titten, die ich jemals gesehen habe. Na, packen Sie doch wieder ein. Verschwinden Sie. And the Oscar goes to... So there you go. Just follow these three easy steps. You'll be a film and television star in no time. And if all else fails, have sex with as many people as possible. One of those times will get you a job. Probably. Thank you.